Hello everyone, welcome to myonlineedu.com's video tutorial. So today we'll learn a few tricks about fixing some issues that you see in Google Merchant Center, shortly known as GMC. So there about you know the products that you have you know in your Shopify website. Okay, so so if you go to your you know uh, GMC setup with the Shopify. So you will see that in the diagnostics, so you'll find few issues like missing value, age group, uh, like mission value, uh, gender, uh, missing value, color, missing value, size. So in this video tutorial, we'll see how you can fix these issues. So first, let's see the examples of the items that has these issues. So normally these issues comes when the category of the product is kind of apparel or merchant. A merchant kind of you know uh, product uh, in in Shopify. So if that is categorized as apparel or clothing or merchant kind of thing, so then so this particular issues comes up in Google Merchant Center or GMC. So for an example, let's say few of the example. Let's take this one. So go to view examples of this error. Okay, and you know you have this option. So these are the list of items that you have, correct? And so here you just check this item. Okay, so this is the item that you have, right? So let's take you know one the name of the item, and then come back to your Shopify store, click on products, and search your products. So here you have your product okay so now here you notice here in the google and youtube right so this app has to be installed and configured with your um, a google merchant center id so th then only the the feeds are going from your shopify store to google merchant center now you know in here click here and then you see the list of you know errors for this particular item that you have so you can click on view product and you know you can see that these are the errors that you have correct so you see that this product category is basically pants as i told you right so it's it's defined as a apparel or you know uh, kind of uh, clothing uh, category right so that is why you know google merchant center picks it up so scroll down to right and you see the age group here gender here so then you can you know what you can do is you can search it like it's for so this is the item for adult right and gender so this is a you know a means so like male okay so there are three options male female and unisex you can choose then again scroll right 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 okay so color right so here you need to put a color so this help says that color is required for apparel items on Google sales channel, right? As I was telling you, right? So this is basically for the uh, um, items which is marked as a clothing or apparel, right? So there you need to put a color. So you know uh, it's a it's a, uh, a navy color, right? So or novel. Uh, so we can we can you know put it like this, and then or if it is a black color, you can put you know black. And then size, right? So size also you can see size is required for the apparel items on the Google Search channel, right? So you can uh, you know uh, give a size you know uh, as Google is expecting, and after that, so let's say it's a large size or something like that, and then you click the save button. So once you click the save button, so these items will be saved. And after few hours or few days, maybe once the another feed goes into Google Merchant Center, you will see the issues for this particular item has vanished from your diagnostics page. So I hope this video helps you to understand the issues in Google Merchant Center and how to solve it. Thank you. Just let me know any questions you have in the comment section, and please subscribe to my channel and uh, you know. Um, and and just uh, you know if you like this video just uh, click the like button thank you thanks for your time